Thanksgiving to get things from the store. Every store is closed. <laughs> I drove 20 miles. Finally found a place called the Lucky Stop Market. They had a line of people longer than something to see Batman. But Cliff, you forgot the canned pumpkin for the pumpkin pie. <laughs> never asked me to get canned pumpkin. Honey, I did ask you for canned pumpkin. I told you to write it down. You said I don't need a list. It's all up here. Are you making sweet potato pie? Yes. Yeah. Well, you got sweet potato pie. People don't know the difference between pumpkin pie and sweet potato pie. You just put some whipped cream on the thing and tell them they got pumpkin pie. <laughs> Dad, you can't have Thanksgiving without real pumpkin pie. Heathcliff, you also forgot the nutmeg. You got nutmeg here. This is not fresh. Now we're making traditional eggnog. And we need to grind it fresh from the nutmeg. Honey, please, go get some nutmeg. <laughs> You're gonna send me all the way back out there for a nut? <laughs> There are the other things that you forgot, honey. You forgot the canned pumpkin, and I might add, you also forgot the dozen eggs that I need to make cornbread. You want a dozen eggs, a can of pumpkin, and a nut. Nutmeg. Dumb canned pumpkin, your stupid eggs, and your silly nut. Nut Meg, and thank you. Could you take those wet things off before you catch a cold? Yeah. There are no eggs in here. There's eggs in there. I put eggs in there. I bought eggs. I don't care what that bag says. There's eggs in there. The receipt says canned pumpkin, canned pumpkin, nutmeg. It says nothing about eggs. You forgot the eggs again. How am I supposed to make cornbread without eggs? People don't need uh, cornbread. Let, let them eat soda crackers. <laughs> I'm not going back out there. <laughs> Paula, this is Olivia's mom. How are you? It's a pleasure to meet you, sir. You staying for dinner? Well, I was invited. I'm not going back out there. <laughs> oh. Oh. Hey, the weather out there is unbelievable. They canceled our flight. Yeah, we can't go on a skiing trip until tomorrow. I'm just glad I have a friend like Phil. Otherwise, I'd have no place to go today. <laughs> Dad, uh, Howard and Denny's parents went out of town, so I invited them over here for Thanksgiving dinner. Is that okay? <laughs> I'm not going back out there.
How did you get cornbread without eggs? Well, honey, I borrowed the eggs from next door. <laughs> Russell. Heavenly Father, you've got that right. <laughs> Heavenly Father, thank you for gathering all of us here to celebrate the many blessings you've given us. And we want to thank you for the new additions to our family who are with us today. Olivia, Martin, and Paula. And dear Lord, while we partake of this wonderful meal which has been so lovingly prepared for us, let us remember those in this world who do not have a place to sleep, nor enough food to eat. And those of us who have been out in the rain all day. <laughs> And we ask in your name that you continue to bless us with the good health and allow us to gather again next year. Amen. 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 Look, honey, could you put those wet things out on the stoop, please?